The word rapture is not actually in the Bible. Mm -hmm. What is in the Bible is caught up. So instead of caught up, we can use rapture. Mm -hmm. The great tribulation is seven years. Okay. But in the seven years, the Antichrist will be introduced to the world. Mm -hmm. He will show the world some kind of false peace for the whole world to give their power. That means that something would have happened upon the earth that will cause the whole world to give their power to what? Mm. To one person. So the abomination of desolation is when they seize the church from praying, gathering, sacrificing, giving, worshiping, the church is scattered. That is what the Lord is saying. When you see it, let those who are in Judea, it means Judea is a city, is a nation, flee to the mountains. Yes, that is where you can find refuge. Mm. For then there will be great tribulation. What is the measurement of judgment? Mm. That someone should be killed and another should just be taken. And then we are likening it to Enoch and all of that. Enoch did not go to heaven. The Bible clearly says that everybody that at that time that died went to Abraham bosom who mm. worshipped God, including Abraham. He said, as yet no one knows the way to the holiest. Mm. Why have it been prepared for you to go? Jesus said, I am the one who brought the way. So Jesus is giving his people advanced knowledge that when those times happen, there will be people who try to introduce someone mm. as the Christ. That is why he's called the Antichrist. Yes, Do not believe it. Do it. They will show even signs and wonders, mm. scientific knowledge, scientific science to deceive many. If it were even possible, the elect. Mm. Elect means what? The saints who are in Christ Jesus, mm. who mm. have been elected to inherit the kingdom. Mm. The 144,000 people, the Lord is a king. Kings mm. don't move alone. They move with entourage. They move with soldiers, mm. army. That's why he will come as a king with his majestic word, throne. And the dead in Christ will rise first. This is the first thing that the Lord has spoken. Mm. If there was going to be a rapture, the Lord was not clear about it. Mm. The dead in Christ shall rise first. Then we who are alive, together shall be caught up. Mm. This is the word that is called rapture. He's telling you the succession. There will be the voice of the archangel. There will be the trumpet. And then the dead in Christ shall rise. And then before the, those people who are alive and remain shall be caught up together with them in the cloud. So we will meet the, the Lord. Lord. Yeah. We will meet, this is the rapture. Jesus will not step foot upon the earth. We will meet Jesus in the air. So nobody is going seven years before time. Check the word of God. This is the great tribulation for you. The Bible says God is able to do exceedingly abundantly above all that you can want. Ask or think. Ask or think according to the power. So it is not automatic. What's your own power? Where is it? It is according to the power that works in you. It's not according to the power that works in me for you. No, it's according to the power that works in you. I can prophesy all the good things even though it is from the realms of God and I'm seeing them I can prophesy to you, but if it is not through you, it cannot manifest for your benefit. Things that can manifest for your benefit are things that work through you. Anybody you hear the word of God, you are taking steps to the river. The river is the word of God. The Bible says the fountain that flows through you. So if it doesn't flow through you, you are not getting the results. If you build yourself on the word of God, you will have manifold testimonies. And no man will be able to stop you. Amen. The reason why witches and wizards can actually torment you is because you are weak in building your faith on the word of God. And somebody says, but the Bible says, faith cometh by hearing and hearing by the word of God. Now, hearing by the word of God is one that you are hearing me. The other one that is even higher is the one you sit and read and meditate to ascertain the things that I was saying was actually what? Of the truth of the word of God. It builds your faith. It gives you confidence. You know what you're about. You are not called a man of God because of the dressing. You are not called 
A pastor's wife because of the dressing or because of your hairstyle, because of the quality of the word of God contained in your spirit. There are too many weak people that we present to represent God. Too many weak people. Sometimes we don't finish grooming people and then we push them into decision making. Then they make the decisions which are weak for the masses. Because they are weak, they can't stand for the truth.
This is the Global Prayer Palace. You are the next person that must read the word of God cover to cover. You are the next person. Lift up your hands. Thank you, Father, in Jesus' name. Thank you, Father. Because in the realm of the spirit, they know they can't kill you. They must give you a weakness. You have never felt weak in your entire life of prayer than this season we are in. Never in your life. You have always been on your feet. Praying, 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 praying. But when your request was getting nearer, something is happening. Do you know why? This one is from your own family. Okay. Because in the realm of the spirit, it looks as if somebody in the family is not happy about you. And so, initiatives and things that you want to take, okay. especially trying to bring the family together okay. and making sure the family prosper, okay. even by the family house, mm -hmm. the place that you have gone to put the blocks. Yes, sir. I was expecting something to come up, and I'm happy you are saying it. That laterite land where the small gutter passes through there, mm -hmm. from there is when you have started experiencing weakness in the body. You have never been that type before. That's why you're here. No, that's why you are here. You don't snatch champions out of... No, no, no. Every message that comes is for a purpose. Okay. And the message targets people. Okay. And you are one of them the message is targeting. Yeah. Am I speaking to somebody here? Yeah. Lift up your hands. I've removed it. Come, because you are becoming lighter and lighter, and you are worrying. You feel within you my health. Yes. You have some faith that God will do it. Yes. I sit under a prophet. If anything, he will see it. Yes. I won't go to the hospital for anything. Not at all. Weakness upon weakness every day and every time. Yes. It's even affecting your performance. Yes. In every aspect. <laughs> even when you work, you go to your office, it happens to you. We go home. As a husband, it happens to you. Mm -hmm. But thanks be unto God, today Jesus has removed it from you. Amen. I anoint you to be a champion for Christ. Be careful what you eat and be careful who you eat with. Don't say, I believe in myself, nothing will happen. Especially when your heart, you feel something just a minute before. And then it will be a pythons. And you say, no, we're going to be a pythons. We're going to be a But now, it is free. If you like, check it. Already. Already. And about the family. Are they coming together? <laughs> Let's put everything together. Father, I thank you. Now, you are you. Amen. Go and continue your work. Amen. Your things are restored. Amen. In Jesus' mighty name. Clap your hands. I appreciate Jesus. It's a wonder, 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 it's a wonder. Word of Life with the Lord's General, Prophet John Anachi. Good morning, wonderful viewers. Welcome to the Word of Life live broadcast with Prophet John Anachi, the prelate of the Worldwide Word Ministries, the Hill City Church, and the John Anachi Ministries. I'm Apostle Chris Wiedemann, and I'm here live in the studio with the anointed prophet of God. Let's pray. Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus, we bless your holy name. We thank you for this day which you've made. We rejoice and we're glad in it. We thank you, Lord, for your mercies. Thank you for your compassions which do not fail. Thank you for your steadfast love. Father, we thank you for the privilege to bring your word to your holy people. We ask in the name of Jesus that every heart, O oh God, will be an open heart, every mind will be receptive to your word, and that your people be built up and blessed by your word. We thank you for this and we give you praise. In Jesus' precious name, amen. Hallelujah. Glory to God. It is a joy to come your way this morning. I hope you are as excited as I am to hear the word of the living God. Can you do well to get your Bible, your notebook, your tablet, 
whatever you need to take down notes as the man of God is a prophet and a teacher of the word. Hallelujah. He's been entrusted with mysteries of the kingdom of heaven, mysteries of the kingdom of God, mysteries of the Lord God Almighty himself. Hallelujah. And I want you to be generous. Do well to share this broadcast. Let someone know that the Lord's general prophet, John Anochi, is on bringing us a word from the Father's heart. Hallelujah. We're live right now on um, YouTube. We have Prophet John Anoche, and then Worldwide Word Television. Those are the two channels we're on on YouTube right now. Prophet John Anoche, and then the Worldwide Word Television channel. We're also live on Roku TV, Amazon Fire TV, Apple TV, and we're also on apps on iOS and Android. For all of them, it's Worldwide Word Television. If time permits today, we'll open up the phone lines and then you can phone in because the man of God wants to pray for family. So get the family ready. He's going to pray and declare God's word into marriages and into family. So be ready for that segment. If we do open up the phone lines, the number to call will be 0540-996670 or 0302-507-154. The numbers are shown on your screen. That's why I went so fast. Good morning to you. Um, <coughs> The Lord's General. Yes, good morning, Apostle. Yes, the man of God, it's a blessing to have you in this generation and to have you bringing us the Word of God. Um, it's apparent that you've gone deep by the grace of God into the things of God. You have a deep understanding of the Word and how things work in the Spirit. And you know, many families, um, even marriages, have been saved through the prophetic unction upon your life. And we give God praise. And I'm so excited that the Lord in this season is doing a work in marriages and in families mm -hmm. so that people, you know, because every now and then you hear people talking about the difficulties of their marriages and how yes. they need prayer. Yes. And so I'm really glad that the Lord mm -hmm. has you doing this work right now. But we just watched, you know, a, a clip of the Global Prayer Palace where, you know, the Lord moves mightily in the midst of his people. You know, he's studying the word closely. I noticed that the Lord is very particular about the needs of his people. You find mm -hmm. that even in Matthew 10. Jesus, before he was done training his apostles, he anointed them and sent them out to go and heal the sick, mm -hmm. cast out devils, cleanse lepers, and all of that. So obviously, he was very concerned about the needs of the people being met. Yes. And I know that the Global Prayer Palace is one place where ample time is allotted to that for people to pray all right, but also to focus on meeting the needs of God's people. Mm -hmm. Now, the, the last and the place was jam-packed. And I want you to just give us, in just a few moments, what really is God's idea for Global Prayer Palace and which kind of people are expected to be at such a service? Praise God, Apostle. Hallelujah. I, I, I want to say good morning to the viewers of Metro TV and the viewers of um, Word of Life, Live Broadcast, sure. um, and, and all the partners of the Ananochi Ministries. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Yes, um, Apostle, it is, uh, it is important in, um, in, this, in this season mm -hmm. and in this last dispensation we are in that um, there would be a demonstration of God's word. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, a demonstration of God's word um, that is active in the lives of the people of God mm -hmm. because um, we've been teaching the word of God. Mm -hmm. And when you teach the word of God, you demonstrate what the teaching is about yes. so that our word our our teaching and our preachings will not be in word only mm -hmm. but also in demonstration power. of the spirit power yes, sir. now so it is important and in demonstration of the spirit power uh, it, it seeks to address the needs of the people and this is the operation of the spirit mm. and um, you know and the bible says everyone and the giftings of the spirit that god yes. has given unto them and so um that is where the demonstration of the spirit is exercised through the giftings supplied by the Holy Spirit mm -hmm. and the offices okay. that we have been given so that it will solve or sort out cases mm -hmm. of God's people who um, have been uh, having an extreme kind of challenges. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah, so that the anointing of God's Spirit, because re remember that the reason for the anointing is to break what yokes. Yes. yes, to break you, set captives free. Yes. The lift Bible says, burdens. yes, lift burdens and to comfort people. Mm -hmm. Uh, is it to comfort those who mourn, yes. to give beauty for ashes. Yes. So if people have gone through ashes and they come to Global Prayer Palace, there's beauty that God yeah, gives them. Do, yeah. I remember one of the kids that was very important. I picked a lady up and um, I began to just prophesy because, um, and I began to hear God speaking to me about the mind of his husband. Mm. And that um, I was seeing something, but I just, 
how to bring it into an understanding to solve a problem in the marriage. So what I did was to mention what the mind of the husband is concerning the wife and what it is that is a problem. So I pick up and I said, the problem is that, um, you know, you tap your stomach, uh, that is an, mm -hmm. an issue. Yes. Your husband wants to That's give seven. birth. Yes. And that, that is the reason why all mm -hmm. those things are happening. But there is, a, there is um, a peculiar problem mm -hmm. that is with the lady. And, um, and it's, it's actually a problem. It's an attack of the enemy. Mm -hmm. But I did not open that up. Yes. Okay? Because the Holy Spirit was instructing me not to. And then I spoke about what the husband likes in her, mm -hmm. which is yes. to see her in her profession. Mm -hmm. as I had seen that. Mm -hmm. So I just said it, you know, beautifully. Yes. That's how the prophetic is presented, mm -hmm. in wisdom. Yes. Yeah, so it tends to be very, very exciting and very sure. nice. But it solves the problem of mm -hmm. people. So you pick cases and it is dealt with. Mm. Because we have already prayed, yes. the word of God has come, declarations have yes. come, and then the prayer, you know, continue. Uh, and the demonstration of the word yes. taught, declarations given, mm. is done on the people. Yes. So there are several cases there. And that is where you need a specific office of the spirit mm. amen amen so you can touch on several cases Hallelujah. and and then the lord so every week it's 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 you touch on cases mm. you know every week and that's why people should keep coming yes because you see that we touch on different cases every week yes, sir. it's not the same people or same no. cases all right mm. if if someone is picked again it means that the holy spirit is working further on yes. someone that is what it means okay wow. yeah it's the spirit of god you know jesus said something in the book of john chapter number Four, verse 48, he says, Jesus said unto them, unless you people see signs and wonders, you will by no means believe. Yes. So, you see, the signs and the wonders pull people into believing, sure. into faith in Christ Jesus. Mm. All right? So you can now, because once the people are pulled, then you can tell them about Jesus, mm. the wonderful works of Jesus. Yes, you can tell them about the mighty works of Jesus. Okay? Yes. And then they will know that Jesus is the one that they follow. You sent me a testimony, very powerful testimony. Yes. A lady was Some about to be come to, mm -hmm. was about to be invited to church. Yes. The gentleman had been telling her, yes. and this is your case, let's go to this ministry mm -hmm. and um, it will be solved. Because she had not been menstruating. I'm, I'm sure she will come personally to for testify. Yes. Yes. She has not been menstruating for years. Yes. Not days, not weeks, mm -hmm. not months, but years. Yes. And, and therefore, there has not been any issue. Yes. And so it is causing problems in mm -hmm. the marriage. Uh, and they said there's theft cases and all of that mm -hmm. also in the marriage. Mm -hmm. A lot of things are going on, okay? And that's what I pray that, you know. And <laughs> yes. And he says, before the day will come, they will come to the, the church mm -hmm. and visit for, for the Global Prayer yes. Palace. She had a vision. Yes. And in the vision, I came to pray for her. So I'm God ministering, to uh, ministering. And then I came to her, minister to her. And when she woke up, she started menstruating mm -hmm. live. Yes. Then she comes to church, and the man of God she saw in the vision happens to be the one who has walked in to yes. teach the word of God yes. and to preach the word mm -hmm. of God. But she has Amazing. her deliverance, yes. a healing, even before meeting, restoration before the meeting. Mm -hmm. That is the work of the Spirit. Yes, the, work of the, Spirit. the Holy Spirit takes, takes the imagery of the prophet mm. and works mm. so that you believe in his man. Yes. Because the words that will come out of him is the word that testifies that Jesus Christ is alive. Hallelujah. That is what it means. Wow, man of God, I'm sure people are excited to join us um, for the Global Prayer Palace. Now we're going to go for a short break. And when we return, the man of God is going to bring us the word for today. Love means that the person is going to mess up, mistakes are going to come. You will forgive and look at the person with the eyes of love. I believe that every marriage that collapses is based on the fact that there have been mistakes. You go and ask the parent of the person whether or not there were no mistakes in the person's life. But they've been accommodating it because yes. there is a love of a parent sure. that is exhibiting. 
and you think they must actually be shaped overnight according to the standards that you have brought in the marriage with, then you will work out on any other relationship or marriage that you enter sure. into because you can never find a perfect person such as the Lord Jesus Christ on earth. But you will find somebody who is growing into perfection. Sure. Even God who desired to bring many offspring unto justification, allows time for development and for growth. You can never mature one day. It takes time yes, to grow. So when we marry, we should be able to allow our spouses to grow. is a word of life with the Lord's General, Prophet John Anochi. Hallelujah, glory to God. Welcome back to the Word of Life, live broadcast with Prophet John Anochi. Hallelujah. Well, man, God, um, last week you taught some really important things about yes. marriage and what is expected of both mm -hmm. husbands and wives. And today we're all ears to hear what the Spirit of God has for us. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Yes, um, um, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Um, Apostle, like, um, concerning the pattern of marriage, mm -hmm. um, even in the, uh, in the Bible, when Jesus spoke about the parables, okay? Mm -hmm. Yes, and, and um, you, you, when you see the kind of wife that Jesus has, okay, which is his church, mm -hmm. now, the, the, that, that wife model is different. Mm -hmm. And I want every man to hear so that they can understand this mm -hmm. side. Okay, thank you, my dear Holy thank Spirit. Thank you, Lord. Um, thank you for using me today yes, for your glory. Lord. Yes, Lord. Um, you will see that Jesus has brought forth his church mm -hmm. as his wife. Mm -hmm. And um, uh, let me, I'm talking about the pattern yes, of the wife. Because in the book of Ephesians, mm -hmm. when we read, he says, Wife, submit to your own husbands, own husbands as to the Lord. Mm. So you are not supposed to submit to another one's husband, husband. or another man. Mm. That is why I tell people that another man do not have right over you if you are not her husband. Yes. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. So submit to your own husbands as unto what? The unto Lord. the Lord. For husband, um, for for the husband is the head of the wife. Yes. He didn't say the husband is the head of the woman. The husband is the head of the wife. Yes, his own wife. So he, you are the head of your own wife. Mm -hmm. the, he didn't say the husband, or he didn't say the man. He said the husband is the head of the yes. wife. Now, if the man is the head of the home, it means that the man has his home. Yes. He has his wife, his mm -hmm. children, that's home. Yes. But you, you as a man cannot be head over somebody's home. No. But sometimes when we hear the scripture, we don't interpret the scripture well. Mm -hmm. So every man feels they have power over someone else's no, home. No, no, no. Or they have power over another woman. Mm -hmm. And men feel superior to women mm -hmm. in that regard. But that's not the point. Yes. Your woman mm -hmm. is the one that must subject to you. Yes. Not my woman. Mm -hmm. So if you see my wife and you want to do anything wrong or talk to her anyhow, know that she doesn't submit to you. You, yes. Somebody says, I'm the man, like, you know, she's just a woman. No, that's arrogance and pride. Yes. Amen. Amen. And, and many men, uh, uh, you know, are, are, are like that. Mm. And they must hear the word of God because sure. I think that um, people did not really study things well to be able to present them mm. as they are. As they are. So when in presentation, we heard. But if you listen to the word of God, it says, wife, submit mm. to your own husbands as to the Lord. Yes. And then, and, uh, the husband is the head of the wife, mm -hmm. as also Christ is the head of the church, and is the savior of her body. So the, that means the man is the savior of the woman. Yes. Okay? You are the savior of the woman's mm -hmm. body, the Bible says. Mm -hmm. And then he says, therefore, just as the church is subject to Christ, so let the wives be to their own husbands. Mm -hmm. Own. Mm -hmm. He emphasizes own yes. husband. Own. And then he says one. In uh, everything. In everything. Mm -hmm. In everything. Then he says, husbands, love your Wife, Christ. just as Christ loved the church and gave himself for her. Yes, sir. Now, if that is the case, let's see Jesus' pattern of marriage. Mm. Because the Bible says that the church 
is the bride yes. of the Lord. Mm -hmm. Bride means that um, there is going to be a, Jesus has picked up his bride. Mm -hmm. And so this is his wife. Once you have your bride, you have mm -hmm. your wife. But there is going to be the consummation, or there's going to be the wedding and the consummation. Mm -hmm. So what Jesus does is to take time to groom his wife to the point that is acceptable, the wife is acceptable to him. Mm. Now, at the time that Jesus is coming for his wife, his bride, to go meet his father, and there will be consummation of the marriage, listen to the model mm -hmm. or the pattern. The wife must be holy mm. and blameable without yeah, fault. Yes, without wrinkle or blemish. Yes. There should not be any fault with the wife when the Lord Jesus, as the king, comes for his wife. Mm, spotless. Spotless. So therefore, it is the responsibility of our, our, ourselves, men, mm -hmm. like husbands. Let yes. me talk about husbands. Yes, sir. Let me not just put the word men. Mm -hmm. Because when we talk about man, according to the biblical concept, it's talking about male and female. Mm -hmm. So let me talk about, you know, um, the husband. Yes, sir. Now, so husbands, okay, are responsible for grooming, training, mm. helping, garnishing, nourishing their wives to be spotless for mm. them. So it's my job to do that. It's your job to do that. Mm. And in doing that, you have to commit resources into it. Mm. So you need to work hard in okay. order to commit resources to it. It's not just by providing the money but you are also responsible for the affections, mm. the emotional, you know, um, you know, needs. You know, you have to be able to yes, satisfy emotionally. Yes, satisfy her emotionally, mm. psychologically, mentally, mm. because women their minds drift away easily. The Bible says they are the weaker vessel, mm. so you need to be able to be there as a sort of teacher. Okay. So if a man is dumb <laughs> in the marriage, it causes a problem. Yes, sir. If in court the woman seems to be smarter than the husband, there is a problem in the marriage. Why? Because these needs may not be met. Yes. The psychological needs may not be met. Mm -hmm. The physiological needs mm -hmm. may not be met. The mental mm -hmm. needs may not be met. The Emotional social... Mm -hmm. Uh, economic needs may not be met, mm. you know, and, and, and I will not even add social to economic. Economic is potent in yes. marriage. <laughs> it's, it's very important. It, it, it stands on its own yes. as a whole ministry. Yes. If it was um, a governmental um, industry or institution, it would have been the economic ministry or the finance ministry. Mm. It needs a, a minister yes. by itself. Mm -hmm. Because if there's no money or resources, financial resources in a marriage, it also can cause a lot of problems. Yes, a lot. Because women needs vary with mm. time. You may have been broke marrying, mm. but don't remain broke in marriage. Yes, sir. That is why you need mm -hmm. to work hard in marriage. Yes, sir. To be able to what, provide mm -hmm. for your wife and your family. Yes, sir. It's very, very important. Mm -hmm. And when a woman comes into your life, everything about them is about money. Mm. Do you know, when a woman conceives seed, Okay, mm -hmm. to be able to check whether the seed is A or B is money. Yes. And uh, for the woman to be able to even go out, yeah, a man, you just wear your things and then you, 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 you take your phone, you are mm -hmm. going. A woman needs to carry a bag. Mm -hmm. Inside that bag are a lot of components. It's yes. like a shape. It has a lot of stages and things in it. It <laughs> needs to be what? It mm -hmm. needs to be done. There must be a lot of things mm -hmm. in there. And that's the, that's the kind of thing. That they are. So everything about them, once they move, it's money moving. Okay. Yes. When they get pregnant, they conceive seed, mm -hmm. the seed will grow. Their cravings and everything is about money. You, you need to get it to mm. be able to feed them. If there's none, they begin to think. They begin to have challenges with you. Mm. It's because that is how they have been made. The Lord says they are the weaker vessel. <laughs> so the husband should render benevolence and love unto the wife. Mm. It's not about saying, I love you. That is not the definition of love. The definition of love is not in it saying it, mm. but it's in it doing it. 
It's an active word, and it is like a, <laughs> a saying word. Amen. Amen. So a lot of people think they can just use their mouth mm. to say just, I love you. And there is no, because Jesus loved the wife and gave herself and gave himself for, for her. her. Yes. And gave himself for her mm. and prepared her until she was spotless mm. and blamable. Glorious Hallelujah. and was presented. Thank you, Jesus. Now, so the same way, you must actually, you went to marry and you have brought your wife home. Mm -hmm. She must not be devastated than you met her. Mm. She must not be, do you understand? She must not, she be, must, she must not be, um, you know, in Chile, in Chile they will say, ne, ne it. Mm. Do you understand? Like wretched. Wretched. Mm. She must not be wretched. Uh, you know, than you met her. Yes. She must be nourished because she's with a man. Mm. She must be taken care of because she's with mm. a man. That is why men must not stay home and then tell their wife to go for prayer so that they can get a job. No, you must work hard mm. rather because then you lack understanding. Wow. You lack understanding in the marriage. Mm. So like I, I was dealing with a case where a, a husband wakes up in the morning and all she... All he would do is to just watch football, television, <laughs> and, and we'll carry the remote, like three of them, and AC remote, television remote, a fan remote, and then, you know, some wine and some um, granites, and then she just, he just goes like, yeah, and then, boom, Chelsea, Man United, this, now, so nothing. Mm -hmm. All right? Then the woman will go, like, that is not your responsibility. Mm -hmm. You show excitement when you have made something. Mm -hmm. You, you, there's, because every man will make money and be excited about yes. it. But you, there's nothing. Yet you're excited. You want to watch football. But the people who are playing football are making their money on you watching yes. them. But you are not making anything. Sure. No, that's an error. Mm. So you are supposed to go out. That marriage won't last. If you, that is the kind of tangent you want to go, mm. it won't. Trust me, it won't last. You, mm. it, it doesn't matter on who you call. You can call the Holy Ghost. You can call the Holy Father. You can call the Holy Son Jesus. <laughs> but your marriage will collapse before them. Mm. Why? Because marriage is married. It's done. It's conducted in the atrium, in the body. Yes. Marriage between a man and a woman is here. Mm. So you need to make things happen. Okay? God mm. is spirit. He won't come and, and marry a wife mm. for you. You must demonstrate that responsibility. So the wife so, can take only so much. Yes. Because when you shift um, responsibility to a woman, the highest they can actually meet is about maybe three to six months. You will feel the rest of the month. <laughs> like when a woman takes over the home for mm. like three months, six months. From six months, I think, she, you know, when she gets to the seven months, perfection is reached. <laughs> She's up to eight. Mm. The, the rest will be an issue. Why? Because that is not what their makeup is about. Mm. They need to that. feel like a woman. Mm. It's like taking care of, because mm. that, you know, that's your wife. So if we understand it, the model of Jesus is marriage, mm. where he has to present the wife, you know, unblameable, yes. spotless. So there is a work done on the wife. Mm. So when men have that kind of understanding, it will be easier for us. Of course, there are times that will be challenges. So that is when your, your wife will be praying with you and trusting God with you so that some breakthrough will come. Mm. But even after prayer, you need to move. move. Because you see, faith is an action word. Yes, if you believe in something, you have prayed, believe that God has answered you, so you have received it. Mm. The receiving is where you, you move because the Bible says receiving is, in, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the Greek term, it says lambano, yeah. take a hold of it. So the job is waiting for you, go and take it. Mm. So don't sit in the house and say, I'm waiting for, uh, for employment. Move. move. You'll get something to do mm. to feed your family for the day. Hallelujah. Glory be to Jesus. Glory. Hallelujah. The Lord. So when you check this one, that is what you see. Mm. So even here in the verse number 25, um, he says, Husbands, love your wives, just as Christ also loved the church mm -hmm. and gave us himself for her, yes. that he might sanctify and cleanse her, 
with the washing of water by the word. Mm -hmm. So Jesus, his resources that he's using is the word. The word. That is why we teach his word to the church. Mm -hmm. his, 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 his beautiful bride. Yes. But you, you, your resources is like, you know, a lot of things. Finance, finances. Yes. Um, because in the word is wisdom, everything mm -hmm. that, the, the, that the, the, the lady needs spiritually to be nourished. Mm -hmm into that state, because Jesus is not just a physical man now, mm -hmm. even though he became a man, now Jesus is the glorified savior. Yes, sir. So when he visits you, he visits you in a spiritual mm -hmm. state, even though he can appear unto your optical eyes, but you have to understand who he is mm -hmm. right now. So he needs his wife to be like that. So your wife is a flesh. So you need to be able to keep up to her flesh. Mm -hmm. You need to be able to, you know, make sure that her mental um, state is what up there. Her understanding is, is, is unique. Mm. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. You have control over resources you know, for her. You have, you have control, you have authority over the home. You know, the day-to-day the, 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 the day -day activities of the home is run by you. Mm. Do you get my point? Sure. That is what it means. You have to take charge. You are the priest of the house. So when she decides that she's tired and she will sleep with the kids, you are the priest. You must wake up to pray mm. and stretch forth your hands and say, I decree in Jesus' name, peace over them. That is what it means. Mm. So it is your responsibility if we look at the pattern like that. That's why I say, mm -hmm. if we look at the pattern, okay? Because Jesus said, follow me and learn from me how to marry. Mm. Love your wife like I love the church. Do this like I do to the mm. church. Do that as I do to the church. So if you want to follow, then these are the things we must follow as men, first of all. Mm. Then we demand, as we have followed, the submission of wives. Submission of wives. Mm. Because Jesus is responsible. That is why Jesus is responsible for sending. And that is why the church must be very careful mm. not to demonize the people that the servants that the Lord Jesus, as a husband, sent unto his bride for their nourishing. Yes. Because he sent people now and then, soldiers to protect them, army to protect mm -hmm. them. Demonstration of God's spirit and power is to nourish the church, mm. which is his wife. Okay. To preach unto them, mm. to teach them, and to groom them, them until they are nourished. Mm. So... Like every department of the church must be affected by the word of the Lord. Mm. So there are men of God that are in different classes, classifications, mm. different categories, come with different methods of the word of God to really release it unto the people. Mm. So when we come, we teach Jesus, we preach Christ. Yes. Because this is, that is his church, his bride, mm. his wife. That is the way he want to bring them up. Mm. He didn't send you to come and teach about yourself. He told you to teach Jesus. That is why even that one marriage should be what? According to the model, a pattern of Christ. Mm. That is what it means. You will have a successful marriage. Imagine the, hus the husband is loving the wife and the wife is submitting. Mm -hmm. So if you are submitting and I'm loving, there's no problem in the house. Oh. So when there is an issue, it means I'm not loving, mm -hmm. she's not submitting, yes, sir. period. That's it. So we need to find out. Mm -hmm. you, we shouldn't blame one person in this. No. There should be that kind of balance mm. work in the family, Apostle. Yes, I believe that, you know, um, if people have understanding of this way, and understanding is key, mm. and in marriage, the husband should be able to, it's a work in progress, so your ego must be buried. Mm. Completely. So it's Otherwise, it won't work. Mm -hmm your ego must be buried mm. so that you work on the marriage. Yes, sir. It's a work in progress. There, there will be challenges. Eh? You know, there are challenges. Mm. You go to the church, there are challenges, but mm -hmm. Jesus knows how to solve them and keep his wife. Hallelujah. The same way you need to know how to solve the problems mm. and keep your home. That's what Glory. it is. Yes. Thank you, Jesus. Well, man of God, we have a few, um, well, just about two minutes before we go on break. What about a husband who will say that I'm providing for my wife, yes. taking care of all her needs and all that, yet she will not submit. And so I want to exert my authority and put her in the place. But sometimes if that? it is not on the premise of spirituality, maybe mm. there's a kind of, um, a spiritual kind of uh, invasion 
okay, mm -hmm. that is actually acting on the character of the person. Usually, that it, there can be an inspiration. Mm. There can be a demonic inspiration. Or oh, there can be also like um, familiar inspiration from the background that is inspiring. Or sometimes there can be friendship influence yes. or something. So you need to check all those things. Then you can block those loopholes. Mm. Okay. After blocking them and you still have that experience, then you will need proper counseling. You need to see someone that your wife respects mm -hmm. that can come in and then begin to what? Talk to her, streamline her, and make her understand who you are in her life. Mm. And, and I think that will, that will work. Yes, so we have to go through all the avenues. Like mm. Jesus, how he sent his messengers. Several classes of messengers and, and servants are sent. Mm -hmm. Yes, just to nourish her. That is what must be done. You must go on all avenues. Yes. As, because, do you understand? Yes. You know, when these things happen, you see that somebody takes a decision and all of that. You can go and marry another person. And the person is even worse than the mm. person you left. You can go and... So it's like, do you understand? So you, you end up tasting a lot of, you mm. know, yes. But that so, is not, yes. Wisdom first, not just trying Wisdom, to wisdom see first. See that I'm the boss here and no. try to be... No, 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 no. Mm. It won't work. Anytime you want to be like that, rebellion will increase. Mm. Yes. Hmm. Rebellion doesn't fear exertions. Mm. No. I hope husbands are hearing this. Yeah, it doesn't fear. You feel like check, mm. read, the, read the books of war, you'll see. When somebody rebel, it's very difficult. Rebellion yes. must be solved from the root. Yes. So deal with it, you know, from the root cause. You can't use a bossy attitude. No, you can't cut that. the tree, just uproot it. Mm. Yes. And then it will be peaceful. Mm. That's what it means. So what the Lord actually told husbands to do to love their wives, yes. that is the wisdom. That is the wise way to get your wife in check. Yes. Doing the right thing. Yes. And the wife must know that your place is to submit. Mm. It's beautiful in submission. Yes, that's your place. Mm. If you want to be happy, because a wife that doesn't submit, your husband doesn't even know what you're doing. Mm -hmm. You think you have dressed well or elegantly or beautifully, but he doesn't notice mm. it. He doesn't tell you nothing. All right? Mm -hmm. Yes, he doesn't tell you anything. And he's not inspired to be loving toward you. Yes. Except he falls on the love of God. Yes. But naturally, naturally there's, there's no nothing. Feeling there's no feeling. feeling. There's no connection mm. because of what you are doing. Yes. But if you begin to submit and mm. recognize that he is your man, he is yes. your husband, I tell you, you will hear beautiful things. You will not wait for the Holy Ghost. Yes. The and if <laughs> some men were not brought up that way, mm. maybe their parents were not romantic, so they never heard, I love you here, mm -hmm. I love you there, you are sweet here, mm -hmm. you are sweet over there, you look good, you understand? Mm. Oh, hey, baby, I'm thinking about mm. you, you are in my mind. There's nothing like that. So they don't know about it. But it's a gradual thing. Mm. Know that this is my man. Can I teach him also? Can I teach him? How to be romantic. Mm. Amen. Amen. Then a man or a ding. Why you know ding, ding, ding? Or that trend. You have to teach wow. him for him wow. to understand. Amen. Amen. Mm -hmm. Well, man of God, it's, it's amazing that <laughs> just the way you're loaded with the wisdom of God for, you know, all areas like when you teach finances, we've had people testifying to the glory of God, even business. People have started businesses. Some have even named them after some of the teachings, and they've seen amazing growth. Amen. And then, you know, in the prophetic, all the office apostolic, and all of that. And then our marriage, and we're still blown away. But we're going to go for a short break. I know normally people don't want us to go for a break. They wish they could keep hearing the word, but I've told you that if you want more of the word, there is the possibility, but we just have to partner so that the man of God can stay on longer. But we're going to go for a break. When we return, the man of God will continue, and then you'll be praying for marriages and relationships. So stay tuned. We'll be right back after this break. I mark her in the name of Jesus. Soon, soon, the Lord open my eye. That's why worship is important. And I saw in the realm of the Spirit, I lose your name from any camp of the devil, any chronic headaches and fever. Yes, Lord. They want to attack your life, your health. Life in Jesus' name. Man. Come out. Out of here. Out. Every attack of the devil against your life, I cancel it. Man. Every attack of the spirit, evil world, opening up unto things against you to fight your favor and your importance, I cancel it. Man. In the name of Jesus. Man. Somebody shout glory be to Jesus. Oh, this 
is the Global Prayer Palace. This and every Thursday at 14 Boundary Road, East Legon, Accra. Also live on World Wide Web Television on YouTube. Light the world with the word of life. Is a word of life with the Lord's General Prophet John Anoche. Hallelujah, glory to God. Welcome back to the Word of Life. Live broadcast with Prophet John Anoche. Hallelujah. I want you to keep those comments coming, okay? I'll do well every week to read um, some of them, if not all of them. Hallelujah. Um, we have a few messages coming in. Um, we have Eugenia Fosu. Um, watching from UK, saying welcome to your Apostle of Science and Wonders and anointed Papa. And then a lot of such um, greetings. Godwin Apedo says, God bless you, Papa, Apostle and the entire team for making our weekends glorious. We bless the name of the Lord for that. Amedro Emmanuel says, very good teaching. God bless Prophet and Apostle. Jules Capone says, wow, it's a blessing. God richly bless you, Papa. And then um, Cynthia Brown says, glory, missing my papa and apostle. We miss you too. I'm excited that most of the comments are coming from uh, men and I'm happy to know who are husbands. And so um, we're learning and then we're excited. You know, it's a blessing to receive the word of the Lord. Amen. I'm sure some women are excited. I said, yes, papa, let them know. Let the husbands know. Yeah. And the husbands also, because we're humble, we're glad that we're hearing it yes. so that we can learn and improve. Hallelujah. Yes, man of God, um, your, your final thoughts before you lead us into prayer and then finally bless the people Thank you, of Jesus. God. So um, by the grace of God, next mm -hmm. week when we meet, Apostle, I'll be able to go on to the spiritual side of things okay. and um, begin to show people as a prophet of God some of the things that we have seen that um, the agendas and the mindset of the devil that, mm. um, um, that, that, that he uses to create... Um, excuse me, confusion in the in marriages, okay? Sure. Um, how he's actually left certain things for certain demonic personalities mm. to inflict harm and pain upon marriages. Wow. And so when you begin to see some signs and things and all of that... He pays that much attention to marriage. Yes, yes, Apostle. Like, he has dedicated actually dedicated... For that yes, wow. demon personalities for that purpose. And so um, during the day, they follow you in the night, they begin to enchant. And so we'll share with you the things that I have seen, okay. some of the things that have been a testimony from also like other men of God, mm -hmm. my brothers that I have that mm -hmm. relationship with and they've shared. Sure. And they can tell you for you to hear mm. some of the things that people see. And it, it can even happen in uh, pastors' homes and all mm -hmm. of those things. Yeah. So it, it's important that you understand what it is. Um, you need to be peaceful. Um, and you need to approach every issue with, 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 with wisdom, with wisdom, intelligence of the spirit. Mm. So as a Christian home, so you can solve your problem. It's hallelujah. important, hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Yes, you don't need to follow anybody mm. for anything. Just follow the word of God mm -hmm. and the strategy of Jesus for you and then pray into the family and everything will be fine. Mm. And as Amen. we have dedicated this whole month unto mm. marriages, and praying into marriages and praying for marriage according to the word of the Lord. I yes. know that definitely your life will never be the same. Amen. Amen. Yes. And so if you permit me, I yes, would sir. want us to begin a prayer right so that next week we can delve deeper into yes, that. Sir. So I want the man of God in the house to help mm. me. Let's begin to pray in the name of Masha Jesus Koraba. into families right now, mm. into marriages. So if you are a, a, a couple, okay, a young couple, mm. you have been in uh, marriage for some time, and all of those things. Um, challenges are happening, don't worry. A couple that is suffering, mm. and you want deliverance, and there may be financial breakthroughs, and all of that, please also don't worry about mm. that. I pray that you have maybe a bottle of oil, or an instrument of prophetic, whether water, whatever you can use to anoint the home. Mm. It's very important, and pray. Hallelujah, so Praise you can Lord. hold it together now as we pray as unity that Father we receive in the name yes, of Jesus. Baruch. Let there be, you know, hear somebody's testimony. Mm. The person was delivered. You know, there were issues with the marriage because there was no fruit of the womb because the lady was not menstruating. Mm -hmm. So this is a spiritual attack. Yes. And so um, th this one, doctors have looked into it, mm -hmm. um, a lot of things. So they've done what they could, okay? Mm -hmm. But nothing was working. Nothing. So this one demands spiritual direction. Yes, yes, it sir. demands the touch of God. Mm -hmm. And that is what when it comes in, then our own is here. Ah, 
Hallelujah. So I want us to pray Thank for you, you in the name Jesus. of Jesus. Whatever that confronts your life, yes. after you have done all the things we have talked about, Kura and yet you are experiencing the some things, mm. know that it is from somewhere, yes, an inspiration sir. of darkness. Mm. Now we are here to rebuke Amen. the works of darkness yes, in the name yes, of Jesus. Yes, Lord. Mashiko. The son of the living God. Rene so Mikos. any marriage that the devil is working against, mm. he has been in bondage, we liberate them in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. From all over the world, wherever yes, you are watching Lord. from, in the name of Jesus, whether you are a wife, you are a husband, you are a couple representing, mm. you are a parent, you are a child, you are actually praying for your family, your, mm. your husband, your, your yeah. father and mother for their marriage to work in the name of Jesus. Uh, marriages that are on the verge of collapse, mm. marriages that have even gone to court for divorce, it can be mended it right can. now. You, in the name of Jesus, Christ, the Son of God. Shiva. Open your mind and begin to pray with me. Yeah, father, we thank you for marriages in yes, the name Lord. of Jesus. Thank Keep you, Father. Thank you, Lord. We thank you for marriages in the name of Jesus. We thank you for marriages in the name of Jesus. We thank you for marriages in the name of Jesus. We thank you for marriages in the name of Jesus. We bless your name for marriages in the name of Jesus. We decree into marriages in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Father. Master Philip Rose. Rabbi, now we are praying in the name of Jesus. We are liberating marriages from bondage and attacks of the devil, attacks of witches, wizards, attacks of demonic attacks, oppressions. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of God, open your mouth. We are visiting homes by Nano Seba. We visit your home by the power of the Holy Ghost. We liberate your family. We liberate Master Talaba. Your marriage in the name of Jesus. We liberate families from sicknesses, from diseases, from afflictions, from attacks on your marriage, financial attacks. In the name of Jesus, dryness in your marriage. In the name of Jesus, we rebuke it right now and we liberate you from that bondage. In the name of Jesus. Be liberated in Jesus' name. Amen. Be liberated by the power yes, of the Spirit of God. Yes, we liberate everybody. In the name of Jesus. We liberate their marriages from bondages. In the name of from oppressions, yes. in the mighty name of Amen. Jesus, Amen. the Son of the Living God, yes, be set free now. Yes. Marriages that are on the verge of collapse, mm. even at, at the court for divorces, I cancel every divorce arrangement. Amen. Amen. I cancel every evil of divorce yes, that Lord. has been put upon your family Arrasha. that you are not able to resolve. Mm. Now, in the name of Jesus, let there be divine intervention. Amen. Let there be a supernatural intervention. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your husband has been bound. In his mind, your wife has been bound mm. in her mind. Right now, receive liberation right now. Amen. Be liberated in Jesus' Amen. name. Be liberated in Jesus' Amen. name. Be set free now yes. by the power of the Holy Ghost. Amen. Be set free now. Amen. We speak peace into the family. Yes. Peace into your homes. Amen. Peace into your marriages. Yes. In the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Marriages that have been experiencing dryness mm. over the years, I command in the name of Jesus, fruitfulness. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Amen. let those marriages begin to flourish. Amen. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. let there be financial breakthroughs. Amen. Let there be promotional breakthroughs. Amen. Let there be job opportunities. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Amen. in the name of Jesus, Amen. Satan, take your hands from take them. Your hands off. Take your hands off yes, their marriages. Lord. Take your hands off this Thank family. You, take your hands off their children. Take your hands in the name of Jesus. Yes. Every affliction is against your marriage Arrabha. and against your home. Be broken in Jesus' name. Amen. Be broken in Jesus' Amen. name. Be broken in Jesus' Amen. name. And be set free right now. Yes, Lord. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. You are free by the power Amen. of the Holy Ghost. You are free by the power Amen. of the Holy Ghost. You will testify Amen. to the greatness of God. Hallelujah. To the Ramashanda. To the greatness of God. Yes, Lord. At the sound of my voice. Lord, the voice of words. The voice of words of power. Yes, Lord. Tender in the name of Jesus. The son of the living. Thank you, Lord. In the name of Jesus. Amen. If any familiar spirit has had a mm. grip on your family, mm. Be loosed in Jesus' Amen. name. Whatever we bind on earth is bound in heaven. Yes. Whatever we lose on earth is loose in heaven. You, be loosed in Jesus' Amen. name. The son of the living God. Amen. And if there has been an issue in your marriage, fruit of the womb, mm. in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the son of God, yes. I see something happening. Mm. I see like a prophetic direction. Mm. Many of the women who are watching me who desire the fruit of the womb, put your hand in water right now you, as I pray. Put your hand in water right now as I pray. Mm. Don't put your hand 
burden on your stomach here, put it in water. Yes. As I see by the Spirit of God, I command you, that Lord. my shadow it shall be done. Father, in the name of Jesus yes, Christ, Lord. fill these hands with your power. Yes. Provide in the name of Jesus. Amen. Let there be fruitfulness. Amen. As when water is water is sprinkled upon any land mm. or rains upon any land and we begin to see things that were dead begin yes. to sprout out yes. or begin to spring forth. Mm -hmm. So in the name of Jesus, this is an element of the Spirit. By the power of the Holy yes, Ghost, Lord. in the name of Jesus Amen. Christ, you shall begin to have fruitfulness. Amen. In the name of Jesus, Amen. your seed will grow. Yes, Lord. In the name of Jesus, Amen. the Son of God. And now put it on your stomach right now. To make contact, put it physically yes. on your stomach. The, the, the physical, like, you know, do you mm. understand? Touch your, okay. your, your flesh. Okay. Your skin. Remano feso manahaya. Holy Spirit of God, let there be no shanda. I command wombs to open. Amen. Amen. I command wombs to be fruitful. Amen. Whatever that what the issue, spiritually, whatever, in the name of be broken off Amen. in Jesus' Amen. name. You Satan, take your hands from their yes. wounds. In the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. And in the name of Jesus, let there be a miraculous baby. Amen. A miraculous child. Amen. In the name of Jesus. Amen. And come and testify to the greatness Hallelujah. of God. In the name of Jesus Christ, the Son of the Living God. Somebody shout, Glory! Glory! Thank you. Lord. You are blessed. You are Hallelujah. favored in the mighty name of Jesus, Amen. the Son of the Living God. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. I know our time is short, but uh, yes. I cannot really speak about the things I've seen. But mm. thank you, Father. Maso fedi bahala. Leso fradi lahatuske. Mero shapari arabosha. Rese fele menoski bahaya. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Apostle, this is the Hamakiva Sada. There's, there's, there's a woman. Okay. Um, um, you, you know, you were having some few things like a dream about your husband and so you were panicking and somebody took you somewhere and the Lord is telling me that it was in the Holy Spirit. Mm. So they gave you a demonic direction to perform. And when you did that, you have actually seen the collapse of the man. It's like the man is mm. going off because the man has started experiencing um, some form of attacks in the dream and it's your image that, you know, he keeps saying, because you are the one that led, you know, you were led there. The person that led you has a problem, and um, spiritual problem. It means that, you know, she is a part of the, the, the thing, and, mm. and you did not know, because you can only see people physically when mm -hmm. you see them, but you don't know the spirit they carry. Yes. Um, I, I just want to help you right now in the yes, name Lord. of Jesus. If you, can, if you can repent, already you are, you are devastated, already mm. you, are, you, are, it, it, you, you know, you are shrinking. Yes. Um, you know, now that I'm speaking, you are shivering. Um, in the name of Jesus, under the power of the Spirit of God, I break that darkness Amen. in Jesus' name. And I command light into your house right yes, now. Lord. God reveals, and as we pray, there's redemption. Yes. There is redemption for you. Thank you, Lord. Right now in Jesus' Amen. mighty name. Thank you, Lord. Ma Thank Sokaba. You, Remember that um, your middle name, you have a middle name, it starts with S. I, I just want to let you know that I, the Lord is the one speaking mm. and he knows the case. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Let the name of Jesus be glorified. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Apostle, I think because of time, there's yes. another person that I see that um, mm. um, you know, he, he, she led her, her husband to eat in a friend's house mm. and that was the one that was collapsing the marriage. Uh, and, and so you don't know the, because there was peace and all of a sudden, mm -hmm. um, you know, started telling you, as for man, you have to do this and all of that. Please, that's a lie. Don't listen to anybody mm. because um, it's, it's a problem. The moment I start, you see, God started opening similar channels onto yes. me. I rebuke that spirit in Amen. the name of Jesus Amen. Christ. I rebuke that spirit. Yes. In fact, you can have a dream and you see that your ceiling is full of serpents. Mm. Okay. And then like you can have a dream and it's like in the car, they start coming out. And that means that you are in the pool. That means that they've been able to deceive you unto their pool. Mm. And so now they are the ones manipulating your life. Mm. But by the power of yes, the Spirit of God. As I begin to speak, I see them running away. Thank you, In Jesus. the name of Jesus, Amen. let the sword of the Spirit cut off yes, Lord. Lord. every Amen. demonic oppression yes. in your lives. In Jesus' mighty name. Be free now Amen. in Jesus' name. Thank you, my Father, you, for your Lord. power and your glory in the name yes, of Jesus. On Thursday, I recommend to you exactly. okay, either the sun, this Sunday and Thursday, mm -hmm. I recommend you just take a bottle of oil Find your way to the number 14 Boundary Road, East Legon, Accra, yes. to the Hill City Church. Mm. Your life is never going to be the same again. Yes. Thank you, Holy Spirit of God. Wow, God Man bless you, Father. God. Exactly what I was going to say. I highly recommend the Global Prayer Palace, okay, to you make it, uh, make it a point to join us 
so that he can be ministered to and then be delivered. Like the man of God said, you see, there's a place for the wisdom of God. The Bible says wisdom is the principal thing. Therefore, get wisdom. And with all your getting, get understanding. So Jesus taught a lot to dispense wisdom. But he also ministered. He delivered people, meaning that he cast out devils, okay? And then also you teach them the word so that the devils are not able to return, which is part of deliverance, okay? So I want you to make a date with us come Thursday, at 5 p.m., we start at 5 p.m. prompts the man of God will minister extensively. Then when he's done, he's able to see a few people, okay, by the grace of God. So if you're out there like that with any kind of challenge or you need a healing, you need deliverance, you need a lot to touch you, then the Global Prayer Palace is the place for you every Thursday at 5 p.m. For those who are not in Accra, uh, you can still join. You can join virtually, okay, by connecting to our YouTube channel, Prophet John Anoche or Worldwide Word Television. So if you're watching us on a TV set, do well to subscribe to our YouTube channels, Prophet John Anoche, and then Worldwide Word Television. If you're outside and someone has spoken to you, you can also join us on Roku TV, Amazon Fire TV, or Apple TV. We have just a few seconds to go, so God bless you so much. Join us same time next week for another powerful episode of the Word of Life Live broadcast with Prophet John Anoche. We love you so much. Jesus Christ is Lord. Enjoy your weekend. People come, great and strong, the like of whom has never been, nor will ever be. O oh, Hill City, and the Garden of Eden before us, were a great privilege of awakening to a life of a new one. Wheat and oil is released, partake of the powers of the age to come. It's worse. The power is in the world. And his authority has been invested in you. The Lord's General, Prophet John Anoche, and the Holy Bologna family every Sunday at 8.30 GMT at the Tree of Life service. Worldwide Word. Raising people to function like Christ Jesus. Light the world with the Word of Life. Word of Life. This is a Word of Life with the Lord's General, Prophet John Anoche. We trust you've enjoyed today's broadcast. For more information, visit www.johnanochiministries.org, www.worldwidewordministries.org, or call 0302-507-154 or 0540-996-670. This broadcast is made possible by partners of John Anoche Ministries.